This is kind of interesting as well. Dog Pound Daily. Three Brown starters that could be replaced by the start of the 2023 season. Uh, number three, Brown's defensive tackle, Jordan Elliott. Number two, Anthony Walker. And number one, Donovan Peoples-Jones. And, um, you know, Jordan Elliott, the, the, the first one we talked about, I'd be surprised if he's starting week one just because he had his chance and, and it was not great. Well, Jordan Elliott, yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, and the other thing is, is would anybody be happy if, you know, a after all that went on this offseason, we get to week one and then we hear that Jordan Elliott's the starting defensive tackle? Um, I don't think anybody, you know, is essentially, you know, ready, you know, for that in any way whatsoever. The Anthony Walker one, I mean, the question would be who's going to start over Anthony right. Walker right now? So you only talkie talkie, you don't believe healthy. He's, you know, look, if he can play week one at all, that's great. You certainly don't think he's going to start at Mike over Anthony Walker. Um, if some of the linebackers we talked about today, if you draft them um, and you draft somebody in, you know, the fourth or the fifth round, you think week one they're going to start over a guy like Anthony Walker? I'm not so sure. And Donovan Peoples-Jones, that's where you get to like a little, uh, hey, is there a little trickiness in the wording of this question? Because, you know, me, it, your top three wide receivers, I don't necessarily need to say somebody is the starter. Now, does this mean that somebody is going to take reps at wide receiver other than Amari Cooper, Elijah Moore, and Donovan Peoples-Jones? That's different. I don't believe so. So, But that, I think there's a little trickiness in the way you're putting Donovan Peoples-Jones' name in there because you know we know the Browns are going to play a lot of three wide receiver sets. The thing that gets tricky is how much four and five are they going to play because you have David Njoku and you obviously have Nick Chubb.